Hello and welcome everyone. My name is Vaibhav Roy. In this video we are going to study about cohesive energy of ionic solids. The resultant force of an atomic system can be given as F is equal to attractive force plus the repulsive force. The general equation of force of an interatomic system can be given as F is equal to A by R power M minus B by R power N where F is equal to A by R power M minus B by R power M rep represent the attractive force plus repulsive force where the A by R power M is the attractive force and B by R power M N is the repulsive force. From Coulomb's inverse square law we have attractive force is equal to A e square by 4 pi epsilon naught into R square. Coulomb's law states that force of attraction or repulsion between two atoms is directly proportional to the product of masses between these two atoms and inversely proportional to the square of distance between them where A is the Magellan constant. We have repulsive force is equal to B by R power N where B is the repulsive constant and N is the bond repulsive constant. The value of N lies between 7 to 12. So we have the resultant force is F is equal to A e square by 4 pi epsilon naught into R square minus B by R power N that is attractive force plus repulsive force. Since the repulsive force is in opposite direction to the attractive force, we get the negative sign for the repulsive force. So work done by the system of atoms is equal to negative of potential energy that implies W is equal to minus of P or P e is equal to minus W. So, work done is equal to integration of f of r dr. After calculating the integration of f of r dr, we get potential energy that is work done uh, is equal to minus a e square by 4 pi epsilon naught into r plus b by r power n. At equilibrium separation, that is r is equal to r naught, potential energy is equal to negative of work done that is equal to u of r is equal to minimum that is u of r is constant so differentiation of a u of r that is potential energy at equilibrium separation r is equal to r naught with respect to r is zero as potential energy u of r is a constant okay so d of u r by dr at r is equal to r naught is equal to zero that implies d by d r naught that is at equilibrium position r is equal to r naught into minus a e square by 4 pi epsilon naught into r naught plus d by d r naught into b by r naught power n is equal to 0 as potential energy u of r is a constant that implies differentiating the u of r we have this equation that is minus a e square by 4 pi epsilon naught into minus 1 by r naught square minus n into b into r naught power minus n minus 1 is equal to 0. That implies a square by 4 pi epsilon naught into r naught square is equal to n b by r naught power n plus 1. That implies a square by 4 pi epsilon naught into r naught square is equal to n b by r naught power n into r naught. That implies a e square by 4 pi epsilon naught into r naught is equal to n into b by r naught power n. We get this equation by cancelling r naught on both sides. That implies a e square by 4 pi epsilon naught into r naught into 1 by n is equal to b by r naught power n. Let us say this equation as 1. Substituting the equation 1 in, in general potential energy equation that is P e is equal to minus A e square by 4 pi epsilon naught into R naught plus B by R naught power n. Substituting the R naught power n value in this equation we have minus A e square by 4 pi epsilon naught into R naught plus A e square by 4 pi epsilon naught into R naught into 1 by n that is equal to the minimum potential energy of the system. So, by taking common a square by 4 pi epsilon naught into r naught negative of, we have minus a square by 4 pi epsilon naught r naught into 1 minus 1 by n, that is the minimum potential energy or the cohesive energy of ionic solid. Units of potential energy or cohesive energy or dissociation energy of ionic solid are 
electron volts or joules. One electron volt is equal to 1.602 into 10 power minus 19 joules. One electron volt is equal to charge of an electron into the joules. So finally we have cohesive energy of ionic solid per molecule or per ion is equal to potential energy is equal to minus A e square by 4 pi epsilon naught into R naught into 1 minus 1 by N whole divided by 2. This is the equation for potential energy or cohesive energy of ionic solid per molecule or per ion. That's it for this tutorial. Uh, by this we have completed the first topic of first unit that is bonding in solids. In the next video we will be starting about crystallography and crystal structures. For all my videos please visit my YouTube channel that is www.youtube.com slash vibhavroyce. If you have any queries, comments or suggestions please email me to vibhavroy at the rate of engineer.com. Thank you for watching.